What are the best handyman gadgets that you can buy that'll make you more efficient on the job? Well, today we're diving into that question. The tools I'm gonna to be sharing with you today are simple and by no means mind-blowing, but nevertheless effective. And if you work on home improvement projects regularly, they're a must-have. Be sure to stick around to the end of the video where I'm gonna share the best handyman gadget to drive screws above your head. So let's jump in. All right, so first up on our list is the Always Sharp Pencil by Swanton. Now, what I love about this thing right off the bat is that it has the design of a carpenter pencil, so it's flat, it's not round, it won't roll away on you when you set it down. You know, I've been in the market for a pencil for a while, I've tried a lot of different pencils, and this seems to be doing the trick, and it really does always stay sharp, the tip. And the reason for that is because there's a bunch of cartridges in here that you insert one here and then a new one pops out. And each one of these cartridges has a really fine tip point. And it's a flat point. Again, you know, it, it marks like a carpenter pencil and it gives you a really nice clean line, clean edge, and it butts right up against whatever piece you're referencing off of. And let me just show you how this works. So I have kind of a dull insert here Put that in there and there you go a new one pops right out and you can see it's really sharp already and it kind of has an angle which is nice too and it retains its its edge for a while and even that dull one I inserted provides a nice clean line still and what's nice too that the packaging that comes with this they give you a bunch of inserts already so this is going to last you a long time. And in conjunction with this pencil, I just use an eraser. I carry this around with me in my tool apron or keep it in my tool bag. And if I need to erase a mark, say if I'm making some marks on a wall to hang some pictures, I can just easily grab this and wipe it away. Next up on the list is my DeWalt utility knife. It's a snap off knife. And you can see it's, it's seen its days. It's, this is probably my second or third one at this point. But I love this. This is my go-to utility knife. And what makes this so great is you have a long blade. So if you say you're replacing caulk on a tub, you know, this is bendable. So you can really get in some tight, some tight corners. And because it extends so long, the body of it doesn't get in the way. So if you need to angle it a little bit to get into a tight corner, you know, you have that kind of room to do so. And let me just show you the design here to snap this off and, and create a new blade. Um, so you just pop this out. Now this little clip, this slot in here, you put the blade in that slot, like so, and then you just push down, there you go, get a nice new clean edge, and uh, that's how that works. Put this back together here, Now DeWalt makes three sizes of these. This is the mid-range, it's an 18 millimeter. They have a 25 millimeter as well as a nine millimeter. But this is kind of the middle of the road size. It's good to hold in your hand, not too large, not too small. So for everyday purposes, this works great. So next up on the list of best handyman gadgets is these hex bits, these hex drill bits. And what I love about these is that you can just use them with an impact driver. So you don't have to keep switching between an impact driver and a drill when you're, say, replacing a doorknob. You can just quickly pop them in and out between this and your driver. So just from an efficiency perspective, these work really well to just keep your workflow streamlined and have less tools that you have to carry around. Now another great impact driver hack is to get one of these a flexible driver and these come in handy for all sorts of reasons you know getting in tight tight spots around cabinets or, or appliances things like that um, this just snaps right into the drill it's got that hex bit and you can see 
You can go at pretty much any angle. I highly recommend picking one of these up. This is just a Ryobi flex driver and you can get this at uh, your local Home Depot. Another great tool to have is this long driver bit. You know, this is about six inches and this is just great to have if, again, you're working in tight spots and the bulk of the driver is too much to get in and unscrew or screw in whatever you're trying to do, like say a doorknob, getting around the knob itself, this comes in handy. And what's nice too is that because it's further out, you can kind of, you don't have to be dead on with the screw, you can kind of angle it a little bit, but this will still work to extract the screw. There's really just so many applications for this and to be without this in your toolkit if you're a handyman or a handy person is just too bad. I really recommend picking one of these up if you can. And this is a Milwaukee and a whole bunch of other brands make these. Pick these up at your local hardware store. Now last up on the list, but certainly not least, is this DeWalt screw grabber. And uh, you can see it extends. But essentially it's got a magnetic uh, rim here and it just holds your screw in place. And this is super helpful for, you know, screwing door hinges up high that are over your head or getting in tight spots over your head um, just to hold the screw. I've been in so many tight, tight locations and especially if you're on a ladder, getting up on the ladder only to have the screw fall once you're up there, it's just a pain in the butt. So I recommend getting one of these. You know, these aren't too expensive. Again, you can just pick this up at Home Depot and it's a lifesaver. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed that list of the best handyman gadgets. Again, they're simple, not mind blowing, but they really make a difference when you're on the job, especially that screw grabber. I've been in so many situations where that has come in handy and I don't have to keep going up and down a ladder because the screw is falling as I'm trying to screw things in over my head. So hope you enjoyed that list. Leave a comment below. Let me know what other tools that you use that make the job easier. Be sure to check out my other video on the best handyman gadgets that you can buy today on Amazon. So until next time, take care and be well.